Welcome to the beautiful celebrity eclipse. As our Greek captain kept saying over the tannoy, and beautiful it really is, especially when you're travelling Aqua Class, celebrity's semi-premium spa-focused package. This short video shows you a glimpse of what you can get for your extra dosh and what we thought of it. The Aqua Class staterooms are located on deck 11, the highest all stateroom deck, and these rooms occupy most of it, except for a few of the larger suites. It's the same deck as the relaxation lounge right at the front, but more on that later. What you get extra to a standard Celebrity Eclipse ticket is very much focused on giving the guest a more relaxing spa-themed experience. There's an Aqua Class exclusive restaurant called Blue, where you can have breakfast and evening dinner, but not lunch. You get unlimited access to the Persian Garden and Relaxation Room. You get little extra items in your stateroom, like an aromatherapy room diffuser, slippers, bathrobes, extra toiletries and a choice of pillows. And you get an upgraded shower in your bathroom. First, let's look at the stateroom. It's the same size as the normal staterooms. The bed has this unusual and rather fancy rounded end, which makes it much easier to walk around. The main drawer unit is nicely styled with plenty of storage space. And the balcony is sufficiently deep so you can lay out on it if you want some privacy to sun your luxuriously smooth legs. More on that later. You get a generous selection of teas and some bottled water. Good coffee would have been welcome too but I guess it's not on the healthy list. The wardrobe is not quite as big or convenient as a walk-in, but the overhead cupboards are really handy for holding extra clothes. Soft ones, mind. Don't put anything hard or heavy in there unless you like the possibility of concussion if it gets a bit choppy. The TV system is your typical in-room selection of films and TV to watch if you're not in a party mood. The bathroom is nicely apportioned. It looks quite sparry, if that's a word, and has apparently a fog-free mirror which I didn't notice. And the shower has an additional panel that caresses you from the sides too, and this little convenient bar near the floor is great for putting your foot on when you shave your legs. Apparently, I prefer to leave mine hairy. Overall though, the shower is fab. But are there any other uses for that little bar? We ate most of our meals at Blue, Aqua Class's exclusive restaurant. It serves breakfast every day and dinner in the evening and the menu is what celebrity call clean cuisine. A pretty accurate description, unless you spill it down you of course. What we liked overall about Blue is that it's relatively intimate and makes you feel like you're on a much smaller ship. The food here is amazing quality and not so calorifically challenged than non-Blue food. That means you can eat more, yay! Unfortunately, I can't tell you what these dishes were because I can't remember. We had the premium drinks package, so <laughs> go figure but they were all finished off pretty quickly. The relaxation room right at the front of deck 11 didn't seem too inviting at first, but once inside and lounging on these little day beds, looking out at the jaw-dropping views ahead, you never wanted to leave. It was a perfect place to relax. We were often in there alone, and it was a little slice of exclusive private tranquil heaven with a view as good as the captain himself. Actually, probably better, because he doesn't have a day bed and I do. Come on, how could you not love this view as we sailed into the Norwegian fjords? I'm afraid I don't have any footage of the Persian garden with its heated stone lounges as it was a bit awkward smuggling in a camera when everyone was lolling around in bathrobes and swimming gear. Guy in a robe with a camera? Hmm, not too creepy. So instead I shall show you the absolutely brilliant gym, filled to the brim with every type of tortuous machine to give your muscles a damn good sesh. And yes, I did use it most days. Honest. Flex's bicep looks disappointed. 
in summary, who can resist a bit of gentle, healthy living, good food and great places to relax, all within an already magnificent ship? Would we do it again? Definitely. Don't forget, at any time you can step outside this fragrant bubble into the wider ship and dance and laugh and get bladded in the ice bar with everyone else, which we did quite a bit. Oh, and before you go, here's a quick montage of what you can expect from my upcoming full review of the Celebrity Eclipse. So don't forget to subscribe and enjoy. Thank you.